another year, another GD common God. It's an old adage that while you are buried in Moscow Media Center, you are often missing more things at the show that people at home are learning while streaming are on social media up from career panels to procedural generation. The DA's wider day of talks was best captured by the developers who showed up learned from each other's work. So if you are still catching up on your conference crowd, we at Gamma Sutra have decided to help you out by cataloging some of the most informative live tweeting bit at DD 2019. Be sure to click on each individual tweet to see their expanded threads. The devil you know may cry. Frequent Gamma Sutra contributor Brandon Sheffield, but still on the ED. With loads of great live tweets, you should take a look at. But we wanted to stop and highlight his tweets about Thursdays. Post-mortem of the recently released Devil May Cry 5 by game director Itaoki Itsuno. Let's see an emotion pick. Twitter, comvp 5 e Itsuno's talk moved from high level to intensely practical, explaining how game designers can work backwards from emotional experiences in order to create a framework for great gameplay. While part of his talk, that can tell some of the narrative arcs for characters like Nero and Dante, he also stopped to compare the game design of Devil May Cry 5 with its predecessor for the audience's benefit. Here's how that looks in Devil May Cry 5 vs. Fire. No more single frames of success. Success is scaled. Pick. Twitter. Come up me at Twitter. Shout. Shout. Let it all out. Sarah Elmler. Anthem voice actor and co-organizer of Game and Death World. Spent this year's DD live tweeting sessions that cover both facets of her career, voice driven lines, and social activism in the games industry. If you are involved in either world, are both you can drop by her Twitter feed for a peek at some of the slides from talks that covered the writing of Lord S. H. N. X. X. in Destiny 2. The idea writing Lord S. H. N. X. X. Destiny talk. Look at this lovely evolution. Went from dry, slightly chastising announcer to supportive space that leeriting at real Lenny Thomas Lenny James, Autumn Shakespeare and Crad, lavishing player W. Praise. Other direct engagement pick. Twitter. Come on, 9 djz 9 w Or you can review her live tweets of the game workers. Unite Unionization Panel. That covered the challenges of organizing unions in a tech industry world. Even campuses are experiencing collective action now. Silicon Valley rising shuttle bus workers. Cafeteria workers. Etc. were able to come together to see other workers offered solidarity and resources. Whether the storm, whether factory co-founder Lottie Bevan left us with two helpful live tweets from DD this year. First, she managed to sum up Jason Rora's in the apocalypse session in one helpful tweet that frankly made it easier for this particular writer to discuss at DD. So at first on Horus in the Apocalypse, Ock was like a math teacher, explaining an impossible problem into something very clear. In the Apocalypse shift from consumable games, one-shot experiences, to infinite unique situation generators, explains a lot about CS. And second, she was able to leave to it her partner in game development, crime. The Lexus Kennedy's talk about the making and selling of counters to simulator, playing into your limitations as an indie, be distinctive, be G. Countists kid art, thanks at engagements, which catches it eye, evokes emotions and can be copied, because it's its own thing, for relatively cheap, allowing us to do a lot with only a little pound, kitty D19. Co-op mode. Naomi Clark, game design professor at the New Game Center, offered up a third live tweet of DDA's panel on how co-op structures can be good for game developers.
But this was not the only appearance of Code Ops at DD. Now at Clady continues with Code Ops 101, traditionally associated with industrial, craft and agricultural labor, not startup businesses, but there is no reason why they should not be. Beyond some companies, reluctance to be egalitarian pick, Twitter, Como CTALCZCHB, during the dead sales post-mortem, Sebastian Binard made a point to call out on Motion Twins co-op status, helped support new team members, and made everyone feel empowered in the decision-making process. From our own coverage, some context for how Motion Twin makes decisions. Bernard stops to call out how Pain helps newcomers feel empowered quickly. The D19 pick, Twitter, comx 95 zebra Chris Dimitis, Ubisoft team, lead game designer is England spends Harry DD doing some exceptional live tweeting. But with D like here to highlight her coverage of the unspeakable horrors that lie beneath your game design. Not the definition. Pick, Twitter, com 9 z i u i b h a w England also like tweeted sessions, like the Interbridge post-mortem which broke down everything from the mechanics that were removed from the final game, and the prototypes that made the game clean, simple, and easy to read. Prototypes gave them an understanding of why genre conventions existed, and a really solid understanding of what worked and did not work. Turned out that telegraphed attacks was the biggest influence on design. Breaks a lot if tactics systems. Pick, Twitter, com one to ylh one u 3 s tooting our own harm. Lastly, we did be remiss if we did not mention our own live tweeting at the show done by yours truly. We tried to succinctly break down a few talks we could not get to in our main coverage, including talks about the animation of the key villain in Marvel's Spider-Man. Math is hard. Here's some simple code. That replicates the math driving of limbs. The D19 pick. Twitter. Come off of slog. To the design and I logic. That gave birth to Atreus in Dot of War. By aligning Atreus. Actions to the players. He felt like a better teammate. The D19 pick. Twitter. Come AJMZJHWFHR. We covered how the developers of Sonatica figured out how to make. Game development itself part of the game product. Here's a loop that will probably matter for many developers today. The D19 pick. Twitter. Come in 5TLS 88LH. And Becca Saltzman's tips for pitching to publishers like Fendi. What should be in your game screenshot? Saltzman has a blog you should read. But here's the core questions she says you should ask. References into the bridge as having perfect screenshots. Pound KDD19 pick. Twitter. Com U W Z Y M P A I. Oh, and before you go, got out such a and DD boss man, Simon Carlos, have some very odd, interesting photos of Abe Newell during Valve's talk about brain interfaces from this year. There are multiple good Abe gap slides in this otherwise serious sandbinder talk. He recognizes that direct access to your brain may not be a socially acceptable interface. The D19 pick. Twitter. Come GPND well CP1. Got out such and DD are sibling organizations under parent company and former over 30 000 games have now been released on Steam. A milestone that the platform quietly crossed in the earliest days of 2019. The number was spotted by PC Gamer over the weekend, and it does not include any DLC or other non-game programs hosted on the digital distribution platform. In fact, adding DLC into the mix makes the number closer to 48. An updated tally of the count can be found by searching for nothing at all on the Steam Store. 
still narrowing down that search to include only games on opting out of an interest-based filter scheme has placed on your account at the time of writing that number sits at 30. That's a little bit higher than the unofficial Steam Tracker Steam Spies on count of 27, 397 lifetime Steam releases. So take the third-party tools numbers with a grain of salt, but Steam Speed did once again chart year-over-year year growth for Steam.